Hello, hello everybody. Welcome on in. I am Orion. We are playing some Deep Rock Galactic Survivor. Today we are going to attempt a world first Hazard 5 Salt Pit Square. Is it going to be the world first? I don't know. But at the time of this recording, maybe it will be. Uh, but we're going to run Hazard 5. I'm going to run the Gunner class. We're going to run the Heavy Gunner, which I think is still maybe the best class in the game. The Thunderhead did get a slight damage nerf, so I'm not really sure. The movement speed might be an issue in this map because there's so much rock and stone to mine through that it could be hard but we'll see if it's too difficult then maybe i'll switch to the juggernaut uh the juggernaut should be pretty good on this map too so but we're gonna try the heavy gunner because i want to get the thunderhead and then i also want to make sure that we get the coil gun the coil gun is going to be huge in this map i think because the coil gun can shoot through all the terrain uh, that's going to be incredible for us because this game, this map has a ton, just a ton of terrain. Um, you'll see, it's basically just all rock and stone. It's, it's literally almost the whole map. So you really want to have good mining. You want to have good speed, uh, things like that. It, it's a cool, it's a cool change in pace for the maps. Uh, I think it's going to be a good addition to the game. So the coil gun will be cool because we can basically ignore the terrain and kind of shoot through all of that. And then the thunderhead is just going to be there for pure damage output. Uh, obviously we want to get the piercing, that's that's why we picked this gun. Um, I did get all the artifacts unlocked, so I do have those. The new artifacts, I think, are pretty good. Um, there's basically no negative to them. One's going to increase your armor for health missing. One's going to increase your damage for health missing. And then the other one just gives you straight up damage, reload, crit chance, and crit damage. It's, it's a little bit of everything, but it's not bad. Okay, let's do the, the Nitra Powder. Okay, we're going to have to reroll this. Okay, luckily we got the coil gun second, so that's awesome. Because I actually didn't, ha I hardly had any gold. Alright, we'll do kinetic damage. Alright, uh, so we have a 4 and a 1. We have Nitra Powder. Decent start. I'm really hoping that we see some of these other ones, though, especially the ones that are going to, like, increase my armor for health missing. That's, uh, I think that's going to be a pretty good one to get. Okay, that's going to be our quest. Objective completed. I guess we'll just do the move speed. Uh, I'm not really gonna get any status effects, I don't think. I don't really, I don't really know what my last two guns are gonna be. There is no, there is no current plan for my last two guns. Probably some sort of beam weapon, but it's gonna just kind of gonna be whatever shows up. That's really how it's gonna go. Whatever gun shows up is what we're gonna take. It's on the hard rock, so... What's gonna make this map hard is, as you can see, these, um... The rollers. The rollers are gonna make this map so difficult, I think. Okay, I guess we'll get the XP now. Just in case. Okay, let's do the damage. Okay, piercing first. Awesome. Kinetic damage. Fire rate. 
They're going blood crazy. Work fast, my nerve. Got it in the mouth. <laughs> Glad we got piercing first, because that's gonna the bugs are getting worse. that's gonna be the way to go here. Okay, let's do the shard diffractor, I think, for our beam weapon. Although I think the breach cutter did get a buff. Both of these are gonna be decent, because the shard diffract there's gonna be so much the shard diffract let's do the shard diffractor. Because the shard diffractor, I mean in theory it should be it should be able to um, bounce off a lot, like especially in the early stages of the map. Right, I'm gonna focus a lot on this guy now on the coil gun. I don't know if I want it to do damage to, to rain. I guess I kind of do. Even though we do have the... Yeah, let's do the damage to terrain. Alright, let's get the extra beam. Cool. Pretty good start. Pretty good start, I would say. The drop pod is about to leave. Get your ass moving, miner. Alright, let's do... Yeah, that was a solid start. We didn't get a ton of resources, but I think we got... I think we got pretty good level ups here. Alright, let's do the reload speed. Let's do you. Let's do the HP. Let's re-roll. The kinetic damage is nice. Well, let's just... Yeah, let's just take it. Let's not risk it. Because who knows what we could get with the next level ups. Okay, so far so good. I would say this is a pretty good start. I think we got three solid weapons. Um, let's hope that we see extra beams here on our coil gun. Because that's going to be really important too. I wouldn't mind getting some better artifacts. Uh, well, actually, we got the Nitro Powder first, right? Yeah, Nitro Powder is good. Let's hope that we can see some good ones continuing, though. Like, I really want to see the new ones. I want to see the new ones that are going to um, help increase my damage. Or my armor. Where is that guy going? Yeah, I can't get stuck in here. Too late, I did get stuck in there. Alright, let's do damage to all weapons. Ooh, look at this. This one, this might be the first ever full one I have seen. Literally every piece of it is full. You have to mine the entire thing. That might be the first time I have ever seen that. We're, yeah, we're going to have to come back. <laughs> I'm not going to be able to make that. Alright, we'll do, we'll do a loop-de-loop -loop for that one. Alright, here's gold and nitra. Alright, let's do the reload speed. Um, we're gonna have to come back around, I think, for this. Yeah, I'll do a loop this way. Grab that flower. The rollies, man. Look at, just look at them. They really make this t difficult. Okay, then we'll do the repulsor for our last one. Alright, let's do the fine nitra. 
Those ones are good for this map. Um, I'm not gonna do lasting. Let's focus on our weapons. Let's focus on our main weapons here. All right, let's do. We can do that mining speed. I wanted I do want to go find one more flower though. Never felt better. Bug yeah, that mining speed is gonna be so nice. So what wait, what did we get? Did we get okay we got nitro. Okay, here's our last flower. Objective completed. Excellent job. Ooh, that did pretty good damage. I wasn't expecting to do that much damage to the bosses. Alright, reload speed, extra beam. Farm a little bit of XP here. Alright, let's do damage. Let's not farm too much though, because I don't want to take too much damage here. Stage two completed. Taking you to stage three. Well done. Oh, we gotta level up too. Okay, let's do this you. Smart pick. Okay, let's do. I really want to get a legendary beam Don't upgrade, so I want to make sure that we have enough. Hmm, what else? <laughs> this is so hard. This is so hard because I know if I pick this and I reroll, the beam's gonna show up. All right, let's go with the damage and reload. One makes it too easy. So then that means I should just take this one then. We'll take the kinetic damage. Oh, that scared me. I thought that was going to be the one. All right, and we'll do the pickup radius. Then we'll do this one. Okay, pretty good upgrade. All right, let's get our nitro. See, just look how much rock there is. Just so much. I was gonna say it was it looks like our weapons or at least our our um terrain destroyer because that counts as terrain huh so our coil gun can destroy that okay we need to get a little bit more tanky here too uh i wouldn't mind getting like a legendary health upgrade or something or some more armor 300 health isn't a lot Especially for Hazard Five. Too much crap to send in the supply pod. Clear out the LZ, please. We're gonna use this to kind of block our path. Man, another almost nearly full one. <laughs> wow, that's rough. we had this guy helping us a little bit that was that's tough that's not easy when it's fully clear it's fully blocked like that all right we're gonna take all right we'll take the blt all right let's do the reload all 
Alright, let's do the reload on you. I really want to get both of these weapons overclocked. The, the coil gun and the, the thunderhead. Oh, that was a magnet, huh? Oh, I no, I didn't pick that up. I'm gonna take that armor. I'm actually gonna take that armor again. I hate it when I get everything I want in the same level up because then it's always a tough choice, but I can get weapon upgrades more often than I can get armor, and I told you I wanted armor. Like, I really wanted to make sure we got some more armor, and there was two blue armor upgrades right there that I just couldn't... I felt like I couldn't really pass up on. Because you're going to get hit a lot in this map. This map is tough because of all of these rollers. The rollers are going to hit you. That's the problem. They're almost... Sometimes they might be too hard to dodge. You know? Well done, you got them all. Yeah. Alright, we'll do because they're gonna even if they don't hit you you're gonna have to kind of divert where you're running and then maybe you run into a path you don't want to run into it's these guys are they're game changers for sure see like even right there just that totally messed up what i was planning on doing all right let's do the damage on you No, I didn't do that the way I wanted to. Like, see how much there is? There's just... there's so much. <laughs> Alright, let's do... I gotta do the weapons. I have to. I have to get these guys overclocked. Oh, see that guy bounced off and then hit me. <laughs> All right, let's do. Yeah, reload on you. Cause once I can get the fire rate and the. Oh come on, let's do the HP. Once I can get the fire rate and the extra beams, we'll be in really good shape, I think, damage wise. Man, come on, give me... I'm gonna take the... I really need this, uh... <laughs> both my weapons are 17. <laughs> They're both 17. Okay, this boss is dead. Let's make sure we get that XP. Okay, now let's do a big old loop around. You gotta be kidding me, game. This is... Wow, this is horrible. This is horrible luck for this last part. Overall, I mean, I still think this is a really good run, but... Man. <laughs> I'm one level away from Overclock. I could have killed, like, all those guys right there. I don't think this guy can get me right here. Oh, I got just a little bit on. Got a little too close. Okay, let's do the damage for sure. Oh, well, we'll get them both right here. Okay, so damage, we'll get the three beams. Uh, let's get that paint job just to get it. I don't care. Um, let's get that armor. I want to get some beam length, though. That's what, I, that's what I would love to see. Let's do... You. I want another go. 
We can do the fire rate because we can really only do one more. This is my pick. Show me more. Let's this do armor. I want to save. I want to get some beam length though for this coil gun. Surely next time will be better. All right, we'll just take the damage to all weapons. Okay, I think we're looking really good now. We got the extra beams. Uh, we got the we got both our guns overclocked that we wanted to get overclocked. So I think we're in <laughs> I think we're in pretty good shape. We're gonna be destroying all this terrain too. Uh, I probably don't really need the mining speed anymore. So out of these ones, I'll take the XP gain. Uh, just because I'm gonna be destroying terrain, I think that's I don't know. The mining speed is probably still useful, but you can see how much terrain we're destroying. So I'm just going to roll with that. Oh, that kills the loot bugs too. Nice. Okay, quest complete. Let's do the reload speed to all my weapons. guess we'll take that XP gain, but we're really at the point to where it's not going to be as beneficial anymore, because we're really not going to get that many more level ups. But out of those options, there wasn't really anything much better. Alright, let's do... Hold on one second. Let's do the... I guess we'll do the reload speed for heavies. Alright, let's do the reload speed on you. Maybe we can get another overclock on this weapon too. the supply drop that we didn't get <laughs> oh no all right uh that's uh, i don't know why i forgot that man that could have been so much better i totally screwed that pooch huh 
At least I got that magnet. Man, I totally forgot about that supply drop. <laughs> I don't know how I forgot about it. At least I got that magnet, though. I'm so, like, I'm so focused on just surviving and making sure. Let's do the damage. Um, let's re-roll these. Let's take the HP. I, I really want to get the beam upgrade. Like, that's what I'm holding out on. I'm really holding out on this beam upgrade. Nope. Try again. Let me yeah, again. well, different, wrong weapon, though. <laughs> wrong weapon. I wanted it for the coil gun. Uh, so now I can't afford, I can't afford it anymore. Um, this actually works out good, though, because I can get some good upgrades here. So let's do those ones. Okay, wrong weapon, but we did get the beam upgrade. Man, I'm so bummed I forgot. I totally just spaced out. Like, I was just so focused on surviving and thinking about like I need to clear this you know like I need to we need to beat this we need to beat this run we're doing good let's uh let's finish it off We have gold tip bullets? No, we have the nitro powder. Well, let's go get the nitro powder. More nitro. So I'm going to clear out as much of this as I can. Definitely not going to forget about this supply drop now. I'm going to go up there and get it right now. Alright, increases your armor. Ooh, let's take the damage one, though. So these were two really good ones. One C so these are two of the new ones, the salty pretzel. Uh 10% damage, 10% reload speed, 5 crit chance, 5 crit damage, or you can increase your armor by 1% for every for one by every 2% health missing. This is a tough one. I feel like we have pretty good damage, so I might not need this. I let's go with this one. Let's go with the survivability. I just, I, I think we're good on damage. We have all the weapons overclocked. We have, um, we have all the weapons. We got the weapons we wanted. So I think at this point, I would rather just play for survivability. And that could be a pretty big armor uh, boost if we lose that, if we lose some more HP. Okay, we're doing we cleared out so much of this this gun is awesome for clearing <laughs> for clearing out terrain like this let's do that reload let's clear this out just in case we need this later the one thing we really lacked was beam range we didn't get any beam range on this coil gun I'm gonna come clear this boss out now, actually. Why the fear? What is this 
I don't want to play around. I just want to get them, get them done. This is honestly why it pays to have so much of the terrain cleared. And then, especially with these weapons, uh, you can just kind of kill everything. You know, we have so much we have so much spread damage and AOE and all of that. All right, let's take let's re-roll. All right, I'll just take the damage on you, I guess. Done. You're done. Let's go. Let's go. We did it. World first. World first. Hazard five clear. <laughs> maybe. Maybe not. Maybe. Maybe. Hopefully. Maybe we're. Maybe we'll be the first one on YouTube. But there we go. That was Hazard five. Uh, salt pits. We did it. Absolutely dominate it. Great. Great build. This is probably one of the best builds in the game. Thunderhead, Coil Gun, just an insane combo. Really, really good combo, especially for this map, destroying the terrain and all that. So yeah, let's let's go. We did it. First try. That was that was pretty easy. That wasn't as hard as I thought it was gonna be. That map isn't as hard as Hollow Bow, that's for sure. Hollow Bow, I think, is still the hardest map in the game. By far. By far. I don't even think it's close still. Salt salt pits wasn't that wasn't as hard because what makes what makes the game hard is when you can't mine through terrain and limiting your movement and where you can go and the vines in hollow bow make it still make this the hardest map in the game. But yeah, that's going to be it, everybody. I hope you enjoyed this. Uh, thank you so much for watching. If you enjoy it, please like, please subscribe, please drop a comment. Let me know what you think. And thank you so much for watching, everybody. I hope you have a great rest of your day.